Hi, it's John from Android Addicts, and today we're going to be doing a battery drain test for the Galaxy S20 Ultra. Okay, so this is the setup. I recorded the phone separately five times to get this result. So as Son rightly pointed out in a previous video I did of this test, you do actually need to restart your phone before the screen resolution or refresh rate of changes take effect. Now, whether that's a bug or whether it's actually just a design of the phone, I'm not sure, but uh, I can assure you that each time I did restart the phone after changing either the resolution or the screen refresh rate. So what we've got here is a 4K resolution video which we'll be playing on loop. The phone screen brightness is set to maximum and we have Wi-Fi on, Bluetooth on, NFC still left on, and we have a SIM card in the phone. Okay, so let's start the test and see how we get on. Okay, so here are the results. 720p at 60 hertz came in at 10 hours and 23 minutes. 720p at 120 hertz, eight hours and 48 minutes. 1080p at 60 hertz, nine hours and 45 minutes. 1080p at 120 hertz, eight hours and 22 minutes. And WQHD plus 60 hertz, nine hours and 47 minutes. So aside from the fact the 720p at 60 hertz won by quite a distance, so it's quite interesting to see from this result that there's actually only two minutes of difference between the 1080p 60 and WQHD 60 hertz. So basically that means if you do want a nice crisp resolution, you might as well go with WQHD 60 hertz because you're only going to lose out on two minutes of your battery life. Obviously the longest performing resolution was 720 at 60 hertz, and between the 720 and 1080 120 hertz tests, we've got a difference of 26 minutes. So again, if you're going to run at 120 hertz, you may as well just go for the 1080p option. So if we just compare the two 720p tests, we can see that there's actually an 18% difference between 120 and 60 hertz. Similar result for the 1080p 60 versus 120, we have a 17% difference in battery life. So bear that in mind, if you're going to switch to 120 hertz, you're going to lose around 17 or 18% of your battery life. And the difference between the longest and shortest times, which is the 720p 60Hz and the 1080p 120Hz, is 24%. So I hope you found this video useful. It's obviously just a test, so you can see the time difference between the different refresh rates and resolutions. Obviously no one's going to use their phone in this way particularly, but it does give you a sort of percentage difference you can work out between the different resolutions and refresh rates, so you can best set your phone for the best battery for what you need. So I hope you found this video useful, please subscribe if you did, leave any comments you have down below, and I will see you in the next video.